I was out to lunch with my friends the other day and we were discussing how some women breastfeed animals. It was a lovely lunch conversation. Oh, I can't wait to drink my milkshake and eat my ice cream. I don't regret at all ordering this peculiar dairy feast for lunch. I'm completely not visualising it as breast milk. You know what? I think it's really sweet that you want to look after the animal. I think it's lovely. I wouldn't do it, ever. Oh, hang on. If it's a life or death situation and your family is starving to death and th there's no feed for the beast and it's your family's salvation, then yeah, go for it. What other option do you have? Maybe you could write a letter. Not naming any names, but let's just pick the most heavily armed societies and say, hey, instead of buying those few extra guns, maybe you could buy me and my family some breakfast. Yeah? No one dies and you don't have to let the animals come suck your boobs dry. I was breastfed until I was 10. Just kidding, that's gross. I remember most of my childhood. If I was breastfed till I was 10, I would definitely remember sucking on my mum's boobs. So I'm really glad I wasn't because who wants that memory? Uh, unless you're Freud with your psychoanalytic complexes and your hatred for women. Yeah. Breastfeeding cats? Not so awesome. You have to draw a line between bestiality and not bestiality. Why would you do that to yourself? Oh, I have to protect my boobs. Here are some facts about cats. Cats lick their genitals and dead mice and birds. Just throwing it out there. You really want their mouth on the tits that... <laughs> Each to their own, but let's not disregard hygiene. Let's not disregard hygiene. Let's not disregard hygiene. Cats put their mouth on dirty things. Let's not disregard that. Unless you're Freud.